Hello my lovelies and welcome back to my channel. So today I have decided to display and organize all of my mugs. These aren't even all of them, which is which is sad, I know, but yeah, most most of my mugs. <laughs> these are the more flashy mugs. Um, I had my husband put up these floating shelves and I thought that would be a great way to display my mugs because I love my mugs, but I don't get to see them, you know? So what better way than to create a little mug display? So if you guys are interested, then just keep on watching. But before we begin, let me remind you that subscribing is 100% free, so please click that subscribe button, and while you're at it, go ahead and click that notification bell so that you're notified every time that I post. I post every single week, so trust me, you don't want to miss out. Alrighty, with that being said, let's move on to the video. I'm pretty sure the rest of it is going to be like a voiceover, so just bear with me as we try to figure the display out. So here I am taking in how many mugs I have and trying to make a mental game plan as to what to do. I was a little overwhelmed, but I always start with what I know for sure. So I knew that these mugs, these taller mugs, were not going to fit in the lower shelves. So I just started off by putting the taller mugs all the way on the top and then I would figure out the order from there. I then saw all of my Mickey mugs kind of grouped together and I thought I would make a Mickey shelf. And this shelf, I had some Mickey Halloween, so I tried to group those together. And that's basically what I did. I just kind of put them into categories so that each shelf kind of had its own theme. I then saw that I had a lot of ghost mugs and they didn't all fit onto one shelf so I had to split them into two shelves but I didn't want them like all on the same side so I decided to put one ghost shelf on the right and one on the left so that it kind of balanced out so you can kind of see a streak of white and they're all little ghosties. I of course needed a Christmas shelf, so I found my Christmas mugs and grouped them all together. I didn't want them front and center yet because I will be decorating for Halloween soon, so I kind of just put them on the bottom shelf. And then as Christmas rolls around, I will be able to move them to the front or even have them on my tier trays. After I was almost completely done with those two rows, I remembered that I had this, like these four shelves right in the center and those, like I, I didn't even think of those and I didn't know which mugs to put there. Since I didn't know where to start, I just went ahead and put my central perk coffee sign up there and just went off of that. I originally started off by just placing some random mugs that I had left over up there, but then I was like maybe I should put my favorite mugs overall, like right in the center. But then I started thinking again and I was like I'm going to be starting Halloween decorating soon, so I might as well put up my favorite Halloween mugs up there instead.
These are all of the mugs that I got in the past couple of weeks. It is so crazy to me. I literally doubled the amount of mugs I have. I did change the left side around, so I thought I'd give you a little close up. Also so that you could see kind of how I categorized each of the mugs. And then I'll give you an overall look. And at the very end, I will show you guys a couple of new mugs that I added. They are in the center, right in front of the central perk sign, so stay tuned for that. Alrighty you guys, so that is it for this organization video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Give this video a big thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!